Nash of Barnes with Sabine Relics. Not doing any digging today. Actually eating some steaks, hanging out, having a good time. Decided to show a few pieces from several hunts ago. I guess all the way back from as long as we've been digging, but we just wanted to show a couple pieces. This piece here, don't know what it's called, but it is one of my favorite ones that I've ever found. I really, really like this piece. I love the notches on it, love the flaking on it. I like the color of it too, it's pretty cool. Found this one walking one day. Not real sure what it is either. It's a pretty fat little point, but it's well made. Real nice point. I was real excited when I found that. Didn't expect to find anything that day, it just kind of fell on my lap. This is the only center I've ever found, and it's one of the best I've ever seen. I haven't quite seen one that looks this good, but I really like it, and I was happy to find it that day. It was the only one I did find that day, but it was a pretty good one. I like this little San Patrice. I like the colors of it. The tip looks knocked off there. It was broke, but it's real, real finely reworked. They did a real good job on that, and they picked a real good rock for it, but it's just one of my favorite San Patrices that I have. I just wanted to show it. This is actually the first arrowhead I ever found. Found that one walking. Real fine arrowhead. Me and Box actually found one a piece that day, and I'll show you the one he found the day that I found this one also. This is a little drill. My dad found this drill. He gave it to me, and it really is one of my favorite pieces. It is just super small, super thin. Just a really cool little drill. But I really like it, and I'm happy to have it. This we've had some debate on whether it's a uh, broken half spear point or a crescent knife or just a knife in general. It is palm wood and it's pretty cool. But you can see on this side where it looks like it could be broke or they just worked around that side. But it's a pretty cool piece. It's about four and a half inches long, but real fine made, real work, <coughs> excuse me, worked real well. Was real happy to find it. Let's scoot over to this side. <laughs> get settled in. This is a few of Box's finds. As you can see, he's got some nice paleo stuff going here. Nice little Evans point. Not sure where he pulled some of these out, but they are some fine points. He's standing behind me laughing because he don't like talking on camera. He got mad at me for putting his face on there the other day. I had to get him. This one went out. I know he found this one out by his house <clears throat> at the undisclosed location but it's a pretty cool little point. Really like it. This is that killer we found the other day. I say we, but he found it. But it was a uh, real nice one. Louisiana Country Boy was telling us it was a Midland and we are gonna go with that. We love it. Just so fun. Made real nice. And this little San Patrice. It's just so well made. Serrated real nice, real thin. Even got some bevel to it. You can kinda see it right there. But it is a real fine piece. Love that one. This was another one I found with him. This is on our little West Louisiana paleo dig that we go to. Just super thin. Real translucent. Just a real nice piece. It don't get much better than that. This one we found on that San Patrice Mound too. We're not as sure on the identification of it. We say that it looks a little bit maybe like a Scott's Bluff or something along that, that line, but we're not real sure. Just super, super thin, fine piece, well made. Love the flaking on it. It's just a real nice, we call it paleo piece, but we really like that one. This is the one where I said I found my first arrowhead. He found this one the same day I found that other one. That thing is G10 all day, real pretty. All the, all the ends have a red on them the tip, just a fine needle tip. It's just so well made. But that one and that one were both found real close together on the same day. Real nice pieces. He's got this one here. Real, real nice one. Not sure what it's called, real thin. Just like it a lot. Just one of his favorites. Real nice piece. And here is a little Friley. Don't get much better. I mean, it's perfect. It's not broken, well worked, just a real nice piece. 
anyway we just wanted to show you a few pieces and we'll let you get back to whatever it is y'all are doing and thank y'all very much for watching